Let's make some beef pho. There are some new ingredients I've added to my recipe and I will point those out once we see them. So first I roasted off my bones. Um, I wanted a dark stock. Then I went ahead and boiled my meat to boil off the impurities. Um, and once I boiled off the impurities, I got a really big pot of cold water and I added my bones and my meat into it. Then I went ahead and charboiled my herbaceous herbs, which were lemongrass, ginger, and um onion i don't think onions nerve but whatever then i went ahead and toasted my spices um get you a mesh bag put your spices in and add that to your stock next is flavoring so i went with fish sauce this is new the spicy beef bumble uh flavoring that's new this is also new the beef flavor fuss stock um i've always used rock sugar but MSG is new. I started asking the food restaurants, like, what y'all put in this? And they would for surely like MSG, sis. Um, then you want to go ahead and you want to get all that uh, fat off of your soup. Um, once your soup is ready to be strained, this will happen. And it sucks. But, you know, just be patient. Um, you'll strain your soup and get all your meat bits. Now is assemblage. So we got the pho noodles. Um, we have the meat. We have the stock. Okay, and this is the first time I ate tendon and it was hella good. Um, we got the cilantro, the green onions, the yellow onions, and then the Thai chili for spice. And you have a perfect bowl of pho. And of course, you got that dipping sauce on the side. Hello. Shout out to Dian Hong.